When it comes to mass vaccinations, Louisville's goal is to get to herd immunity as soon as possible. That means a majority of the population needs to get vaccinated. We also asked him today about the move to fire two more police officers involved in the Breonna Taylor case. Kristen Goodwillie has more from the mayor. Where do these mass vaccinations go from here? Do you think that the pace is going well as expected in Kentucky? You know, we've approached it here in Louisville with a real methodical kind of prioritized approach so that there's not going to be just craziness when people come to get the vaccine. We're seeing that in some states right now where there's thousands and thousands of people lined up overnight for a couple hundred vaccines. So I don't think that is an efficient way to do it. It's certainly not treating the people right as well. So our approach has been uh, much more logical in my view, and it's working well right now, and it's going to scale up also. So when people can get appointments, it's uh, best for them to manage their time. We're going to continue going that way. So what is this task force that you guys are creating? The vaccine task force is really critical to scaling the vaccine. So we're calling it an all-in approach so that we can vaccinate as many people as quickly as we can. So we've got the public health department. That's what you see going on at Broadbent facility. You've got hospital-based vaccinations going on. You've got vaccinations taking place on site at long-term care facilities. You can expect that there will be other community operations, lo locations opening up in the coming months as well. So the task force represents all of those folks so that we can make sure we're getting as many vaccines out to the right people as soon as we possibly can. And then the second task force has to do around communications. So we wanna make sure that we're getting the right message to the right people at the right time so they show up to be vaccinated. Are you guys still expecting that tier 1A will hopefully be finished by the end of January? Yeah, the approximate goal right now is to start tier 1B, that's the teachers and people over 70 around February 1st. Now that's dependent on vaccines arriving, the supply of them. I'm confident we're gonna be able to administer them. We're showing that as well, but that's the approximate date. But this is all gonna change quite a bit as we get more vaccinations, as the supply chain becomes more understandable as well. And then you'll see different spots uh, pop up in the community on where the vaccines can be administered. LMPD Interim Chief Yvette Gentry is going to decide about whether there will be a termination of Joshua James and Miles Cosgrove. What are your thoughts about this process and why is it coming now? Yeah, well, good try. Uh, as you know, uh, State Law 67C really prohibits me from talking about uh, any of this disciplinary process. I mean, I can confirm, obviously, that it's taking place. That's been well publicized, but outside of that, I cannot make any comments by state law.